Hi folks, it's me, Darren. Welcome to my channel. If you know me, you know that I love to travel to Germany. In fact, I love to travel to Germany every chance I get. But one of the places I like to go to, which are very many, but one of the places I like to visit is Wiesbaden, Germany. I love the town of Wiesbaden. It's not too far from Frankfurt. It's easy to get to, and it's just a beautiful, beautiful city. Yes, uh, the U.S. military is there, uh, United States Army. Uh, I never was stationed there. I was in the Army myself in, in Schweinfurt, Germany, and I lived in Gießen, Germany, too. But uh, I never was stationed in Wiesbaden, but I visited Wiesbaden from a, a child and when I became an adult. And to this day, I'm still an adult, and I still travel to Wiesbaden. But uh, Wiesbaden is a, a beautiful city, and I... We'll put this in one of the must do's to do, even if it's, if it's just a day trip there. There are many, many things to do. Now, if you like to shop, if you like to walk around, um, you know, the shopping areas of pedestrian zones, uh, this place has it. Uh, now, Wiesbaden, they call the, the residents there, they call it the Rue or the Rui. I heard some, uh, some of my friends of Wiesbaden call it the Rue. Some say the Rui and some just Rue. And uh, you, you got to really... <laughs> You know, got to listen to it, but that, that's what they call it. But uh, it's the uh, Langasse, Langasse Strasse right there. And uh, it's just beautiful. There, there are over 130 shops. I mean, you just keep walking, walking, walking. You see all, 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 all these shops, uh, ice cafes, restaurants, and all oh, you, you name it is there. Uh, the last time I was in Wiesbaden was uh, last June. That was June of 2023. I took my son with me, as you can see here, and uh, we had a, a great time. The food was phenomenal. Uh, spaghetti ice was phenomenal. Phenomenal. And also, you know, I was walking around the grocery store, and guess what I found in the in the grocery store in the fr fr frozen aisle? Spaghetti ice. Yes, I found spaghetti ice in Wiesbaden in the grocery store. But anyways, back to, to my point. Wiesbaden uh, is a beautiful city. There, there are many points of interest that, that you could check out, many landmarks you could check out. I mean, there's just so many to mention. You got your uh, architect, all, all the beautiful buildings. Oh, my goodness. The the churches, the museums. They have beautiful. I love museums. I'm a museum guy. I'm one of those who I stay in the museum. I, I read everything. But you got all this historic walking area that you can walk around with Wiesbaden, and it is beautiful. And you can do it. By yourself just get a city map look on your app there's all kinds of apps you can find or you can even get a private walking tour there's plenty of those too if you wish to do that um they do have private walking tours there's many there's some like a half hour duration there's a two hour duration one i think it's a six hour duration too so whatever you want to do do it on yourself or or hire somebody to take you uh, either way uh, it, it's fun but trust me, I, you could you could probably do it yourself with a little bit of research and, and a little bit of a little bit of footwork. But anyways, I'm not going to keep you long this week. Um, I hope you enjoy this video, and uh, if you ever get a chance to go to Germany, you know, make sure to check out the town of Wiesbaden. And on a side note, if you're watching this right now, I make itineraries for people. I make itineraries. I love making itineraries for people so they could travel to Germany. And I don't charge a thing. Now, I will say this because I get asked this all the time. It's, it's getting pretty popular. Um, people say, well, you know, you don't charge anything. No, I, it, it's, it's for I do it for free. I really do. Um, but if you want a tip, you're welcome to tip. I never asked for it, but I'm always asked this. I'm always asked, you know, do you take tips? The answer is yes, I do. But that's not why I do it. I do it because my love for Germany, my love to travel to Germany, and I love to share it with people. So if I could help you in any way travel to Germany, feel free to contact me. So until then, I'll see you in the next video in Germany. It's coming up. You just keep on watching. All right. Dankeschön und tschüss.